Hi, I'm Eleanor. Hi, I'm Benedicta. We're going to be doing a science project together of the magnetic field. Ready? Today we're going to be doing a scientific experiment on magnetism. We're going to be testing the magnetic field and uh, doing an, ex an experiment on what interferes with the magnetic field. So, um, what you need for this project is an index card, some tin foil, also a pin, and a paper clip with a string attached, a magnet, a cup, and tape. We're going to tape the magnet to the cup. Then we're going to tape the cup to the table. Now, we're going to tape the paper clip, or we're going to tape the string on the paper clip to the table so that the paper clip will float like a balloon. We're going to put these things in between the magnet and the paper clip and see what will interfere air with the magnetic field. First, uh, we're going to try the index card. It's not interfering. Okay, now we're going to try a piece of tin foil. It's not affecting it at all. Now let's try a pin. It's wobbling. It's definitely wobbling. Now we're going to try another paper clip. Let's see if that interferes. It knocked it down. Why would these uh, interfere? Let's see if the uh, any of these things are magnetic. First, let's try an index card. Sure. What about the pin? It's magnetic. Let's try the tin foil. It's not magnetic either. How about the paper clip? The paper clip is definitely magnetic. The pin and the paper clip affected the magnetic field, but the index card and the aluminum foil did not. The reason is magnetic materials will interfere with a magnetic field where or whereas unmagnetic materials have no effect